Hello there everyone. Today we're going to read Never Let a Unicorn Crash a Party, written and illustrated by Diane Alba. This is my pet unicorn. Over the past couple of months, we have really gotten to know each other. And I discovered something pretty awesome about her. She loves parties. She loves pool parties. She loves scribble parties. She loves dance parties. She loves tea parties. She even loves cleaning parties. I wanted our next party to be the best one yet. I remembered that Unicorn's birthday is coming up and she has never been to a birthday party. Then I thought, what is better than a birthday party? <gasps> a surprise birthday party with her friends, balloons, donuts and crafts. <gasps> It'll be amazing. I reached out to all of Unicorn's friends to tell them about the surprise birthday party. They loved the idea. We started planning. First, I sent out the invitations. Then I made a list of everything we needed. Balloons, donuts and crafts. And lastly, I needed to get Unicorn to the party without her knowing it was a surprise. So, I told her I got some new princess dresses that I just had to show her and told her to meet me tomorrow afternoon at 2pm. Everything was going as planned. I had the balloons, Penguin bought the donuts and Raccoon got the crafts. All that was left was to decorate. After what seemed like forever, the decorations were up and they looked marvellous. Now. All we needed was Unicorn. We timed it perfectly. Just as Unicorn peeked through the door, we all shouted, Surprise! Surprise! But what happened next, we didn't expect. Unicorn went bananas. She had never seen balloons before, and one actually looked just like her. She ran full speed to give it a big hug and ended up crashing into all the balloons. <laughs> Unicorn was so startled by the noise that she started running in the opposite direction. She wasn't looking where she was going and crashed into the donut table. <laughs> Save the donuts! I yelled. But it was too late. The donuts were flying everywhere and all the balloons had been popped. The only thing that Unicorn hadn't crashed into were the crafts. I quickly ran and grabbed all the paper to bring it to safety. What I didn't realise was that Unicorn had stepped on a donut and was sliding right toward me. Then she crashed into me. Her magical horn went right through the stack of papers and caused them to burst into glitter snippets. Unicorn finally landed on the floor belly first. I was sure the party was ruined. Then the most magical thing happened. The donuts started to float in the air, lined themselves up and drifted onto Unicorn's horn. Then all the glitter snippets started to arrange themselves into the most fantastic mosaic art. It's safe to say that things didn't end up like we expected, but we still managed to have an amazing party and learn some new things along the way. We discovered a new art technique, saw some great donut stacking skills and found out what happens when a unicorn crashes a party. So the next time we have a party, absolutely no surprises. <laughs>